So we are at the beach already and we're waiting for our first ever guest on the Blind Surfer Show. And he's like a pretty fairly decent surfer, right Josh? He rips. <laughs> he rips. He rips and he might be here. Stay tuned. Is that really him? How do I know if it's really him? <laughs> <laughs> How you doing, buddy? Good, thanks for coming out. Yeah. You can't wait down. for two seconds? Does that what? bother you? Yeah, no, no, not at all. Well, the waves are uh, not exactly huge, but... I still feel like you're doing something better on them than I would. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Today is even pretty small for me. Yeah, we're not looking at a heck of a lot. Yeah, but it's okay. There's something to ride. Okay, cool. <laughs> um, you want to get out in the water or what? Yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, I, if there's something out there, we can find it. I say we do it. No time like the present. Let's go. Is that the shark side or is that the what? Yeah, it's, we had a credible shark sighting a little while ago. So say. Just, just posting signs to let the public know. Well, that's great. They're all getting out. Let's go. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Why do you want to get out of the water? Just have to it must have been like a group lesson. Yeah. Or, or they saw the shark. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well. Big fish, not shark. Don't jump to any conclusions. Yeah. Could be a whale. You think there's really a shark out here? I don't know where else you're gonna find a shark, but it's not on the land. Yeah. This is where they live. Yeah. <laughs> well, we do have three lifeguard trucks in front of us. Yeah. Okay. I mean, it would make for a hell of a video. Blind surfer surfs with Taylor Knox and gets attacked by sharks. <laughs> or outruns a shark. Maybe. Maybe you know, I like your positive it. thinking. I didn't think I was going to get it. I felt like it was going too slow. Your like, hair is still dry. Right? Oh, yeah. Oh, good job. Catch one wave. That's professional <laughs> right there. It is. Now I'm on the tour. That was the last class of my qualification. You need to qualify with yeah. that one right yeah. there. Just not get your hair wet. <laughs> <laughs> This is like doing a backyard flag football thing with your friends and having Peyton Manning show up to play quarterback. This is awesome having Terry Knox out here. Yeah, I've been doing that a little bit. If I do know I'm going left, I put my hand in there to ride and feel. Yeah, just look at the arm. You can make sure you use your elbow too. You can bend your arm at a 90. Yeah. You do that in the tube when you can't see. We put our like forearm against the wall of the barrel so we know kind of where we're at. In forward. In forward. In the knees. <laughs> Yeah, that's sick. Did you hear me yell lean forward? Yeah. <laughs> you came up and totally went back down. That was yeah. legit. Does that count as a turn? We'll, we'll see it on the video, yeah. but yeah. He kind of had an uppity downy. Uppity downy. <laughs> that was super cool. Good job, Good job, it was fun to feel it like keep going. I'm like, oh, it's still going. I'm yeah. still riding. Yeah, you feel like the control of it too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I did, I put my arm out like you said, and I felt that I was getting kind of far away, and that's when I did my uppity down to the, I went back uppity to it. Uppity down to the. Yeah. Yeah, you go in the pocket though. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
he pushed me and made me get into it. I wasn't going to get it because he pushed me. That was awesome. I was making frowny face because I thought I was too slow and I missed it. And then all of a sudden I sped up. It was, yeah, the shark pushed me. Thanks, Sharky. Awesome. Did you see any big fish? Um, yeah, a couple sharks. Yeah, nice. We're petting them. <laughs> <laughs> Made friends. Awesome. Sharks yeah. in Carlsbad are so friendly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They're not like other sharks. That was a great time. Awesome. Two words. What? Josh, you're fired. Oh, no. Josh, you're fired. Josh, you're fired. Josh, you're fired. Josh, you're fired. I think Taylor might have a little something else to do in life, but uh, that was awesome. Yeah, thanks for inviting me, Pete. Really so appreciate it. Yeah, thanks for coming out, man. Yeah, yeah Josh. Really cool. That was cool. Yeah. Well, hopefully, we'll get a couple more sessions in, in the near future. Oh, cool. Cool. Awesome. Thank you. All right. Really thanks. appreciate it. It's been a great day surfing with you, Pete. It's been a lot of fun. Yeah, yeah. man. Can't thank you enough. Yeah. Man, Pete, man. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> That's and, always uh, the one where you can tell he can't see. Yeah, that was awesome, man. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah, yeah the successful definitely. handshake might be one of the highlights of the day because usually I go to the bump, someone that's handshaking, or yeah. <laughs> punch someone that wasn't doing anything. <laughs> well, we just got out of the ocean, so we're clean. Yeah, we're <laughs> okay, hold on. We got more with Taylor coming up, but I wanted to jump in here before everybody went crazy in the comments going, I can't believe you idiots surfed when there was a shark out there. Once we found out there was a warning, we had Brooks flying. Actually, the lifeguards asked Brooks to fly his drone all all over the place for a long time and the only thing he saw was this seal so we're pretty sure the seal was the so-called shark but just to be safe we had another drone flying the entire time we were out there Jacqueline was operating that one she was way up high keeping an eye out for any potential big fish that might be coming our way so no Taylor and Josh didn't try and get me eaten by a shark we were safe now back to more Taylor the channel is, is about surfing, but not about surfing. It's about helping people to, to overcome things in their life and live their best life. And uh, Banana was reading an article to me that you uh, were interviewed in talking about your meditation. And I think a lot of people get into their jobs. I get into voiceovers, you get into surfing because you love it. Right. But eventually things become a job and you can kind of lose your passion. Right. And uh, the article I was reading was you helped find your passion again through, what was it? Well, uh, I yeah, I kind of lost my passion. I was doing, you know, I was in surfing. I've been in for a long time, and you know, you go through hills and valleys in your career. And when things are good, they're great. And when things are bad, you have, you know, you got to find a way to find that inspiration that what drove you to do it in the first place. Because um, you just get you just get pulled off center. And so I met I met a guy named Ron Rathbun who does. He teaches Keeley meditation. Um, he developed it too, and. Uh, it's really simple, you know, it's 10 minutes of your day of stilling your mind and, and not focusing on, you know, breathing or any mantras because the whole point of doing it is to focus on primary point and primary point is you. These two tell me all the time I need to be more zen. Yeah, there's, there's, such, um, there's such great value in, in just a peace of mind, like a real peaceful mind, even if it's for like 30 seconds, that can set the rest of our day off in a really good good place and and it's always about getting back to center and uh, to do in life what you want to do not what you're being told to do by someone else I'm more into the meditation than he is but he's <laughs> a way he's more successful at doing that turning your brain off thing at night anyway yeah a lot of people you know they 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 come to meditation sometimes just for the simple reason that they want to sleep better Yes, that's then, why I do it. You know, I, li I listen to a meditation app. They can't app, turn right? it off at night. And she hasn't slept really... in two and a half years. I, oh, that's a lie. I haven't slept for like 12 years. <laughs> yeah, I mean, and sometimes it's just that reason. Then when I get into it, they go, oh my God, there's so much more that I'm getting out of this and just sleeping better. Yeah. Uh -huh, I'm turning it back on you. It was about me not being zen. Now it's about you not sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it's it's true. It is true. It's about everyone becoming a, a reaching their full potential. 